is your Kalpana here in this video we are going to solve a differential equation firstly we will factorize the given differential equation and then we will use solvable for p method to solve the given differential equation so let's get started problem solve y p square plus x minus y of p minus x equals to 0 solution given differential equation y p square plus x minus y into p minus x equals to 0. By factorizing, we get y p square plus x p plus into minus minus y p minus x equals to 0. Now take p common from the first two terms. You'll get p times y p plus x. Take minus common from the next two terms. You'll get minus of y p plus x equals to 0. Since y p plus x exists in two terms or in both the terms, Take yp plus x common from the two terms. We'll get yp, yp plus x of p minus 1 equals to 0. Then yp plus x equals to 0 and p minus 1 equals to 0. So we'll find solution for yp plus x equals to 0 and p minus 1 equals to 0. Put p equals to dy by dx. Okay, let's consider yp plus x equals to 0. Then yp equals to minus x. Then y into put p equals to dy by dx. y into dy by dx equals to minus x. You can write this as y into dy equals to minus x into dx. Since the variables are separable, so we can integrate on both sides. Integral dy, integral y into dy equals to minus integral x into dx then y square integral y dy is y square by 2 equals to minus integral x dx is x squared by 2 plus integral constant c then y square equals to minus x square plus 2c again you can write this 2c as c then y square minus x square. y square equals to minus x square plus c. Now take these two terms to LHS. You will get y square plus x square minus c equals to 0. Which is solution for yp plus x equals to 0. Now we will find solution for p minus 1 equals to 0. Consider p minus 1 equals to 0. Put p equals to dy by dx or let's rewrite it as p equals to 1. Now put p equals to dy by dx. Then dy by dx equals to 1. Then dy equals to 1 into dx is dx. Now we can integrate on both sides. We will get integral dy equals to integral dx. Then Integral dy is y equals to integral dx is x plus integral constant c. Then you take these two terms to LHS, you will get y minus x minus c equals to 0, which is the solution for p minus 1 equals to 0. 
the combined solutions will be the solution for the required sorry will be the required solution for the given equation therefore the required solution is y square plus x square minus c into y minus x minus c equals to 0. So we have seen a problem from solvable for pain in this video. Hope you will understand. We will see you in the next video. Until then. Bye bye.